if the honeycomb is sweet. If it's sweet, I'm gonna get it. If it's not, I'm gonna get ube. Welcome, we're in Hotel Charlotte and we're gonna see Yosemite tomorrow. What the hell? <laughs> Come on! Give them more information! Uh, okay, fine. Okay, go. Welcome, we're here in Hotel Charlotte. We just finished a two and a half hour uh, trip all the way from the Bay Area going to our uh, BNB. We're gonna stay here overnight because we didn't make reservations and it's currently peak season. So in order to see Yosemite, you need reservations during peak season unless you enter before 5 a.m. So tomorrow we're going to try to get up very early to go and enter Yosemite. We're about an hour and 15 minutes away. So we really want to be prepared like two hours before then because we don't want to be rushing. And that's great because sunrise is like around 540 and there'll be light out. There'll probably be light out and we can go see the sunrise. Mm -hmm. Launch is about to take one. Wow, vlogging 101 from the famous Look at me, I'm TikToker. An <laughs> Yeah. Side. The history at the back of the menu. We are ordering food from Charlotte Tavern in our hotel. Guys, the island door salon across is not, it's not very safe for us, so it's a big ass menu. <laughs> so cool. Oh wow! Guys, this is the sweetest thing I've ever seen today. Look. Wow. It's so bright. It man. is so dark. Because it's so dark, I'm filming. It's so pitch But you have this light in our face.
Wow, what a view. I'm here in Glacier Point, which is our second stop for today. And from our previous point, which is the valley view, that took about one hour. There's no gas stations on the way, so make sure you come prepared because from point to point, it is quite a drive. You have to be prepared for how big Yosemite is. So right behind me, over my left shoulder is Yosemite Falls. And we're just enjoying this view right now. If you come in the morning and you come to this side of the park, you're gonna have a lot of against the light photos. But if you look towards the trees during the morning, then it's not so bad. So I'm thinking more towards the end of the day. You're going to have better lighting. So I'd recommend this place afternoon. Restrooms. The restrooms really come prepared. If you can find a cleaner restroom before you get to Glacier Point, go there. There are ample amount of restrooms. We saw about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about eight or 10 stalls. They're not the best smelling. We saw a guy open the door and say, oh, sh <laughs> take a whiff, and it wasn't that great. Yeah. Nature smells better, but come prepared. Really come prepared with food, wipes. restrooms, come prepared with wipes, and of course, alcohol. Yes. So do that. Also, there's gas stations, but it's just not along the way. Yeah. There's gas stations inside. Probably. Two gas stations that we saw, just not on the way to Glacier. Posa, giant of sequoias. Here we are. We drove 55 minutes from the welcome Yosemite Welcome Center, 55 minutes to Mariposa Parking. Took the shuttle two miles from the Mariposa Parking, and now we're here. The shuttle only has two points it's from parking to the trailhead and trailhead back to parking. Private vehicles cannot enter the trailhead, only um, shuttles and authorized vehicles. Look at how big this is. Our last stop for today. From 4.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. <laughs> They're giant.